That's no ordinary scenario. That's hell in a cell. Lost in Anza near to the 30th. That cell door slammed here, locked inside it. The fear is real. For the first time ever in Boston, it's WWE hell in a cell. Heed my words. The scars you will not heal from. The scars that will haunt you for a lifetime are the emotional wounds that will not heal. It's WWE hell in a cell live in Boston, Sunday, October 30th. Tickets are available. This is Mick Foley. This is Harley Race. This is Shelton Benjamin. This is Mr. Wonderful Paul Orndorff. This is the Monster Abyss. And this is Daniel Bryan. This is JBL and you're watching the MWF. Be there live. Wrestling fans from around the corner and around the world. Welcome to another installment of Wrestling Insiders. I'm Dan Marotti here at MWF Studios just north of Boston in downtown Melrose, Massachusetts. 02176, the zip code of champions. Stay tuned after the news for some awesome money-saving deals where you can support indie wrestling. Very sad to report that Frenchie Martin, the real-life Jean Gagné, has passed away at the age of 69. Frenchie had battled bladder and bone cancer for over a year and was in hospice care. Martin's career began in the early 1970s, working territories throughout Canada, then throughout the world. He was a top star in Montreal, as well as for Stu Hart's Stampede Wrestling and Carlos Colon's WWC in Puerto Rico. Frenchie made his way to WWE in 1986, starting off as an undercard enhancement wrestler. He hosted an interview segment on Superstars of Wrestling called Lay Studio. This was a weekly interview segment similar to the Piper's Pits and Brother Love shows of the era that aired exclusively in Canada. You couldn't see them in the United States. He transitioned to a managerial role in late 1987, replacing the luscious one, Johnny Valiant, as the manager for Dino Bravo, a memorable duo for its time. Frenchie was by Bravo's side at the first televised Royal Rumble in 1988 when Bravo broke a weightlifting record. At WrestleMania IV, when Bravo competed in the WWF World Title Tournament, losing to Don Morocco in the first round. The duo went to war with the Olympic strongman Ken Patera in the summer of 88. At the debut of SummerSlam in August 1988, Frenchie was with Bravo and he defeated Morocco in a WrestleMania rematch. Frenchie and Bobby Heenan were the co-managers of the Survivor Series 1988 team, co-captained by Bravo and Andre the Giant, along with Harley Race, Mr. Perfect and Rick Rude, that defeated Jim Duggan, Jake Roberts, Ken Patera, Jim Brunzel, and Tito Santana. At Royal Rumble 1989, Frenchie and Jimmy Hart led Bravo and the fabulous Rougeau brothers in a losing effort to Jim Duggan and the Bushwhackers. And at WrestleMania V, Martin again managed Bravo to victory over rugged Ronnie Garvin. After the match, Ronnie gave Martin the Garvin stomp. Soon thereafter, Jimmy Hart became the manager of Bravo, and Martin would go back to being an occasional enhancement talent until retiring full-time from the wrestling business the following year. He'd continue to appear on independent wrestling events throughout Canada and the United States into the 90s. We send our condolences to the family, friends, and fans of Frenchie Martin. It's a hot summer on WWE Network with WWE NXT and the Cruiserweight Classic lighting up Wednesdays along with SummerSlam and not one but two pay-per-views with Backlash and Clash of Champions in September. Not currently subscribed to WWE Network? Come on now. Use our link below and get one month absolutely free. Get the pay-per-views live, the awesome weekly shows, and over 6,000 hours of on-demand content for free. See Lesnar and Orton at SummerSlam. Holy Foley, brand-exclusive pay-per-views, and so much more. At its regular price of only $9.99 per month, it's the best value in sports and entertainment. You want to talk about a great summer sale? Head on over to the MWF store on the BostonWrestling.com super site. We've got brand new WWE t-shirts, autographs, action figures, posters, and more. And this summer, I have a special where if you spend $25 or more, you get a WWE t-shirt absolutely free. Not only is it a great deal, but every dollar spent helps our endeavors to bring you action-packed live events and video content. Enjoy 1,200 free videos on our YouTube channel as we count down to our 15th anniversary. We're releasing a new video each day at 12 o'clock, flashing back to highlights and even a few lowlights on the adventure that is the Millennium Wrestling Federation. Subscribe to our channel using the link below or use youtube.com backslash bostonwrestling.com. We also have regular news videos, TV episode recaps, results, interviews, and so much more. 
help us bring you even more great video content by donating an amount of any size to paypal.me backslash boston wrestling again every dollar donated helps us bring you more great live events and video content that wasn't enough we have a new video on demand section on youtube where you can either rent or own some of our classic state-of-the-art studio shoot interviews in honor of the 10-year anniversary since the original no holds barred iron chic studio shoot interview went viral and on the howard stern show we've remastered it and made it available for fans around the world to enjoy for as little as 5.99 we also have an awesome WrestleMania 1 Roundtable studio shoot with The Sheik, Mr. Wonderful Paul Orndorff, and Cowboy Bob Orton, where all three WWE Hall of Famers look back at the WWF boom of the 1980s. John Cena Sr. joins me as co-host for in-depth studio shoots with both Paul Bearer and the first and only shoot ever done with The Boogeyman. Paul Dempsey joins us and pulls back the curtain on WWE NXT. Again, not only can you rent or own these awesome interviews, but every dollar goes right back into our efforts to bring you live event and video content. Another easy way to help our efforts is to use the links below or on the front page of the BostonWrestling.com super site to do your shopping on WWEShop.com, Amazon.com, or Walmart.com. If you make a purchase on any of those websites, wrestling-related stuff or not, we get a tiny kickback, and best of all, your cost doesn't increase one cent. Hey, Christmas is going to be here before you know it. Please keep us in mind, as again, every purchase made helps support indie wrestling. Last but not least, have a free ride on me with our friends at Uber. That's right. If you've never used Uber before, get a free ride up to $20 on the house to try out their great service. Forget about overpriced taxi cabs. Uber service is great. The cars are clean. The drivers are some interesting folks. Use the link below and see for yourself. I tried Uber for the first time last October in New York City for the WWE Madison Square Garden event, and I've used it regularly ever since. You won't regret it. Running out of time here, folks, as we approach our 15th anniversary. Don't miss a day on the BostonWrestling.com super site as you never know what's going on in our world. Like us on Facebook.com backslash MWF Action. Follow us on Twitter at MWF2001. And again, subscribe for free to our YouTube channel at YouTube.com backslash BostonWrestling.com. Until we speak again, folks, you and yours, be well.